Welcome back to Explaining Everything, the channel where we dive into the stories and mysteries behind everyday things. Today's question comes from one of our curious viewers, Snack Attack Sam. Thanks for the suggestion, Sam. You asked, how does an air fryer actually work? If you've ever tossed in a batch of frozen fries, pressed a button and felt like a five-star chef without touching a drop of oil, you might have wondered, what's really going on inside that little magic box? Is it frying? Baking? Or just blowing really hot air with confidence? Today we're cracking open the science that makes air fryers turn ordinary snacks into crispy masterpieces without the guilt, the grease, or the lingering smell of deep-fried regret. So, if you've ever bragged about your healthy fried chicken or questioned the sorcery behind those crunchy results, stick around. We're about to break down how your air fryer actually works, right here on Explaining Everything. Let's pop open the hood of this so-called fryer. Inside, there's no bubbling oil bath, no sizzling grease, just a heating element and a fan. That's it. It's basically a small, glorified convection oven that went to a branding workshop and came out calling itself an air fryer. Here's what happens. You toss your fries or chicken nuggets into the basket, hit start, and the air fryer's fan starts blasting hot air around your food, usually between 150 degrees Celsius and 200 degrees Celsius. That rapid air circulation cooks your food evenly from all sides, crisping the outside while keeping the inside tender. It's kind of like a tiny tornado made of heat and hunger. The hot air zips around so fast that it browns your food through a process called the Maillard reaction, the same chemical magic that makes toast golden and steak deliciously brown. So, yeah, the air fryer's secret ingredient isn't air, it's science. Now, why is it even called an air fryer? It doesn't fry, there's no oil bath, no bubbling cauldron of cholesterol. It's more of an air baker or mini heat stormer. But let's be honest, turbo hot wind box doesn't really sound like something you'd buy at a Black Friday sale. The fryer label is pure marketing genius. It tricks your brain into thinking you're eating something fried, even though your fries are technically roasted but because it uses just a spoonful of oil, or sometimes none at all, you get that same crispy texture without feeling like you've swallowed a deep fryer. So, you can tell yourself you're eating healthy, and technically, you are, until you fill it with mozzarella sticks, frozen pizza bites, and churros. Then, it's just a crunchy lie we all choose to believe. Here's another air fryer mystery. Why does it cook food so much faster than an oven? Well, it's all about size and airflow. Traditional ovens are big and take time to heat up. An air fryer, on the other hand, is compact, so the hot air doesn't have to travel far. It's like the difference between heating up a mansion and heating up a shoebox. The shoebox wins. And since that fan is pushing air at tornado speeds, your fries don't just sit there. They're getting roasted evenly and quickly. Some air fryers can cook a batch of fries in under 15 minutes. That's less time than it takes to argue about what to watch on Netflix while the oven's still preheating. Let's talk more about that browning magic, the Maillard reaction. It's the reason your fries turn golden, 
your bread crusts get that toasty color, and your coffee beans smell heavenly. When the air fryer blasts your food with heat, it triggers a chemical reaction between amino acids and sugars in the food. The result? That irresistible, crispy, golden brown exterior. Basically, it's your food caramelizing itself into deliciousness. So the next time someone says, I made air fried chicken, what they really mean is, I used science to make this chicken crispy while pretending it's fried. Of course, air fryers aren't perfect. They're small, which means you can't exactly fit a Thanksgiving turkey in there, unless it's a turkey nugget. And if you overload the basket, your food won't crisp up. It'll just steam. Congratulations. You've made sad, soggy fries. Also, if you forget to clean it, that leftover grease at the bottom? It'll smoke up your kitchen faster than a failed cooking TikTok. But when used right and cleaned occasionally, it's an amazing little device that makes crispy snacks faster than you can say. Diet starts Monday. Air fryers became a kitchen sensation because they hit all the right notes. Faster cooking less oil, and a crispy texture that satisfies your fried food cravings without the guilt. Plus, it makes you feel like a culinary genius. You toss in frozen nuggets, push a button, and suddenly you're Gordon Ramsay with better cholesterol. And let's be real, the real reason people love air fryers. It's because you can make fries at midnight without waking the house or setting off a smoke alarm. So, to sum it up, your air fryer isn't frying. It's just blasting hot air around your food really, really fast. It's part oven, part science experiment, and part illusionist. And honestly, who cares if it's not real frying? If it tastes crispy, it's close enough. If you enjoyed this crispy deep dive into air fryer science, hit that like button and subscribe for more brain-tickling explanations about the everyday things you thought you understood. And if you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our other bingeable channels. Thank you for tuning in and join us next time here in the channel that answers all the why, what, who, where, and how questions you've always wondered about here on Explaining Everything.